Welcome to Union Channel. This video content is about how to use USB-C to HDMI cable. If it's of interest to you, don't miss it. If you feel like you need a bigger screen to watch movies or set up dual monitors for your work, what you need to do is source out your content to another bigger, better screen. You have USB-C connectors in your mobiles, tablets, and some laptops. For monitors and TV screens, you have HDMI connectors. At this time, you will require USB-C to HDMI cable. But what are the exact requirements and exactly how to use USB-C to HDMI? Let's find out. Step 1. Connect the USB-C plug-in to your USB-C devices. Make sure your host device provides video out, which means the USB-C port must supply DP out mode. DP out mode. Alternate mode is a feature in USB Type-C, allowing for transmission of video signal. Step 2. Connect the HDMI end to the display, plug to the monitor or screen you want to display the video. Step 3. Turn on the TV or monitor and select the correct input source. So easy to implement, but if you still encounter some problems, read on. Problems with USB Type-C port An important thing to understand is that not all devices with a USB Type-C port can stream data through a USB-C to HDMI cable. USB has different standards, namely 3.0, 2.0, etc. This differ in terms of data transfer speed. A USB Type-C port may support any of these standards, but to provide output for an HDMI port, your device needs to have a USB-C 3.1 port or a Thunderbolt 3 port, which supports DP out mode. USB-C 3.1 would either mean USB 3.1 Gen 1 or USB-C 3.1 Gen 2. If you are thinking about what a Thunderbolt port is, by looks, a Thunderbolt port is the same as that of USB-C port, but the difference lies in speed. Thunderbolt 3 gives a maximum data transfer speed of 40 Gbps, which is 4 times that of USB-C 3.1. Problems with Cable Reliability Compatibility Choose a trustworthy brand. Before you buy your USB-C to HDMI cable, you need to make sure that it is compatible with your device. Problems with specifications From devices to accessories to monitors, if the ideal resolution is not achieved, we need to troubleshoot the resolution of all linked devices. For example, when you choose Uni's 4K USB-C to HDMI cable, but the actual result is not obtained, it is possible that your device does not support it or the video source is not originally 4K 60Hz. Above is the guideline provided by Uni about how to use USB-C to HDMI cable. If you have any questions about it, please leave a comment below the video or email the Uni team for professional guidance.